Thousands across the world tuned in this afternoon to watch the U.S. women's soccer team take on Spain in the Women's World Cup. The news sheet online's Aaron Cooper shares how two soccer playing sisters from Georgia love the game so much that they wouldn't miss this match for the world. Aaron. Josh, Latricia, the U.S. women's team who have won three of the last seven World Cups have inspired generations of female soccer players. I met two young ladies this afternoon who told me all about their love for the game, their team, and each other. Any other summer afternoon, you might find Gabby and Anna Silva outside practicing their game. But on a World Cup year, they've got something else to do first. We've watched it for as long as I can remember. Decked out in their Team USA gear, Gabby and Anna let me sit in on their USA versus Spain watch party. Go, Rapino! Oh. <laughs> Gabby, who's played soccer for 13 years, just graduated from Cahulla Creek High School. She was a defender for their soccer program. Uh, me and my sister got to play for our first year together. Little sister Anna, a rising sophomore at the same school, is just as decorated as her sister. She played, you know, before me, so I'd always go to her games and like love to watch and love to hey maybe that could be me one day. Gabby will be continuing her soccer career at Dalton State next year. She beamed with pride as she spoke about how much she admires Anna. To see the player that she's becoming I've grown it's been amazing because she's one for her age she's incredible and she's one of the greatest soccer players that even I look up to being older. Sitting shoulder to shoulder the two inched to the edge of their seat watching their idols. Their abilities have brought um, a new light into uh, female sports. As close as soccer has made these two, Gabby says the best part is how this sport brings strangers together. You see everybody decked out in their United States gear. I mean, strangers high-fiving and hugging each other. And like, I think that's one of the most beautiful things about this sport is how, despite what you believe, despite your race, uh, political beliefs, like everybody comes together. And for a moment, nothing matters, no differences matter. And everybody's cheering on the United States. And of course, Gabby still got some playing and playing time in today. After the game, Gabby headed out with her future Dalton State teammates to play a scrimmage at a summer camp with some local refugees. Josh. Aaron, thank you. Team USA defeated Spain this afternoon 2-1. World Cup games air on our other channel, Fox Chattanooga.